The Haven Restaurant in Epping, a destination for summertime comfort food, ducks, and at least for today, Democratic candidates for Congress. Terrence O'Rourke wants to get big money out of politics. If the Democratic Party isn't for standing up for the people against concentrated wealth like big banks, I don't know what we're here for. Deglin McEachern says fixing health care is his top priority. I'm in this race because the system didn't work for me. You know, my wife got sick and it was an incredibly difficult process. And we're seeing throughout the district, everybody that we're talking to, the system isn't working for them either. Chris Pappas says his small business experience sets him apart. In Washington, he believes Democrats must oppose President Trump on policy without mudslinging. I don't think that we will succeed by being a mirror image of what Donald Trump represents and being more outrageous than how he's conducted himself as president. Mark McKenzie says his campaign is built on his years of experience as a leader in the labor movement. I'm ready to hit the ground running in Washington and to take the fight that I've been engaged with for so many years to D.C. Naomi Andrews served as incumbent Congresswoman Carol Shea Porter's chief of staff and campaign manager. She wants to carry on her legacy. And I'm just going to continue. And that's really important in terms of coming in in January 2019, no learning curve. Maura Sullivan is new to the state, but brings to the race a record of service in the Marine Corps and the Obama White House. Served at the VA and served at the Pentagon. Uh, and I'm ready to serve again uh, and step up and lead at this critical time in our country. Lincoln Soldati was the first candidate in this race to call for President Trump's impeachment. He's also emphasizing health care as a singular issue. But it really is health care and single-payer Medicare for all that I have uh, just completely uh, uh, adopted. I want to make it a national priority. Mindy Mesmer is a state rep leading efforts to clean up contaminated drinking water. Climate change and drinking water protection, the Department of Defense says, are the top two threats to national security, and those are right in my wheelhouse, being that I'm a scientist. Only one candidate, Levy Sanders, was unable to make it here during the five hours we spent at the Haven Restaurant. We hope to see him next time on the road. In Epping, Adam Sexton, WMUR, News 9.